Hey my legion, how y'all doing today? I'm here today to review the Netflix show Squid Game. Is it is it does it live up to the hype? While reviewing Vigo Jumbo Squid and Marinade or Marinade sauce. Let's open it up, see what it looks like, and I'll get on with the review of both this and the TV show. Okay, this is a look at the squid. It was like a dollar sixty nine at Walmart. And one, I mean, marinade sauce. Um, now the show. Uh, I remember hearing about Squid Game uh, and my buddy John because we watched in classic horror movie. And all of a sudden, well, he has that different display for Netflix. I had the old school one that just shows the boxes and stuff like that. You go through the thing, but his had one that's more interactive and stuff. I just like the one on my computer now uh, that displays Netflix that I kept seeing Squid Game. So what the hell is this show? You know? And I think the next day I saw something on uh, the nightly news saying is Squid Game, uh, the new sensational show on Netflix. And they said it's probably going to be the most successful language, uh, different language uh, shows on YouTube, if not their most popular. And then all of a sudden I started seeing, you know, it's real successful. Then all of a sudden I saw all these uh, videos saying, like, Squid Game's boring, Squid Game's overrated. Don't want, I'm not going to watch Squid Game and neither are you. Because it's like, this culture is so negative and stuff like that. Like, there's channels on YouTube called I Hate Everything. I try to be, give everything a fair shot, not just be so negative, say, well, this show's going to be awful. Or like, you know, or like saying it's going to be boring. I see some boring stuff. You know, if and if a show sucks or it's boring, I'm going to tell you. It's not like I'm going to say, like, you know, I'm not just going to say it because the show's popular, right? Or, or, I mean, you know, the people will decide what's popular. Not like some talking about on YouTube or the channel, unless it, the show sucks, you know. Anyways, I saw the show, and the show is like this group of people. It's a South Korean show group of people who are, like, down their luck and, like, completely in debt to the point, like, they're drowning in debt. Like, have you ever seen movies like Blad, Bad Lieutenant, like, yeah, Blad, Bad Lieutenant, where he's so far in debt? Or movies like, uh, I think James Conn did a movie like that. I mean, you know, you've seen movies, or, what the heck was it, that movie, uh, Uncut Gems, where Adam Sandler was so in debt, and so he got deeper and deeper. And they decide to, uh, they have an opportunity to go to this one, uh, place where they play these games, if they win, they win money. But they didn't find out it was a bunch of kids' games. If you win, you win money. If you lose, you die. Yeah, I think it's a fascinating show. Uh, it's not perfect. First two episodes drag a little bit, but I don't think it's as bad as people say it's boring or you shouldn't watch it or uh, it's overhyped. I don't think so at all. I like the show. And it's cool. And it goes in a bunch of undis... Uh, what do you call it? Unexpected directions and stuff? Because it wasn't predictable. I mean, I didn't think it was predictable at all. I, I really enjoyed it. Not perfect. But it's tough to have a show that's perfect a lot of times nowadays. I give it about 8.75 out of 10. I give it a squid. Mm, about seven and a half out of ten. So, yeah, that's my review of Squid Game. I like this. I think it's awesome. I don't want to give away any spoilers, but it's just an idea of what the show is. I thought it was cool. You know, sometimes don't listen to all the negative. They just do to get views. Ah, this show. And then people just jump on the bandwagon. You know, they say something's popular, and they'll automatically say it's bad. The new call, a new uh. You know, I've had it, even when I was in the army, you know, I was 21 and they had like the 19 year old, so cynical. I don't know where the whole cynicism came into saying everything sucks. It doesn't only sucks if you let it suck. Or if, and if it does suck, you know, I'll tell you if it sucks. So that's my review of the Squid, Jumbo Squid, and the show Squid Game on Netflix. So until next time, bye, please take care of my Legion. Look at some of this stuff, Reed. Look at this. Look at that. Mm.